Good morning, ting. There's nothing like a good warm shower. I'm human again. On this realistic day in my life, I wanted to really show you guys how you can have a slow, productive day even while you're on day one or two of your period creating the healthy habits learning how to incorporate them so you can just stick to your goals you don't want to drop the ball just because we are going through this unfortunate week we know that it's coming so it's nothing better than to just prepare you will be able to stick to your routine and i'm just here to give the advice and the tips that i know and that i enjoy and i hope you will enjoy too I'm currently brewing my tea. We've always heard that coffee is not good to drink when the period is here. So I decided to stop a week before my period was coming. I guess preserve the amount of horrible cramps that I necessarily get. So I will say I am very proud of myself. My cramps are far from as bad as they used to be. I've never did this experiment before. I was always afraid because I need my coffee. I feel great. I feel greater than any other month I've ever had. I will be doing this moving forward. For my breakfast, I usually always incorporate some sort of coffee or tea, eggs, oatmeal, or fruit, or all the above. When my period is here, I incorporate work as well as rest. I always make sure I listen to my body first and foremost, but at least I write down things I know I want to do, the goals that I've wanted to achieve for the week. And I do all of that prior to. I I schedule my weekly planning weeks in advance. So I'm already aware my timelines, my goals, what needs to get done, certain deliverables that are mandatory, whether I'm feeling good or not, because the work still got to get done. That's adulting, right? Make sure to incorporate food. Make sure the food is racked up. I don't care. This is the time to indulge. Our bodies are going through everything you can think of under the sun. I'm not a pill taker. Any food and even my robe, anything that I enjoy, I will be doing. I have my oatmeal and my boiled eggs and my black tea. Had a pretty late start today, which I'm very gra grateful for. I love being able to sleep in, but I do have a very slight headache, and I'm hoping it's just because I haven't ate yet. So technically, we are having breakfast for lunch, early lunch. It's a little after two o'clock. My headache has definitely gone down tremendously. I'm done watching YouTube and done having, you know, casual, just me time. And now it's time to be productive. Hence is why I have on my blue blockers. I'm about to start on my laptop, get a little bit of work done. I motivate myself like I feel good. Nothing's really wrong. I'm not feeling crampy. I'm not irritable. I feel good and then it's nothing better than wanting to work from your bed now I'm going to play some lo-fi I love listening to lo-fi music when I have to just woo-saw and just clear my mind especially with all the noise and everything that from everyone else in the house lo-fi just calms me out I get to just get the work done I'm not thinking about anything I'm not rapping to my favorite tunes lo-fi rain sound That was such a great work blocking moment. I feel accomplished and ready for tomorrow and for the weekend. I love doing stuff like that and I got to do it in the comfort of my bed. Love, love, love. Now it's snack time. We have some fruits. 
kombucha mixed with orange juice is just a little vitamin C kick that I love to do all the greasy great indulging food is going to come for dinner so I try my best to just snack and eat as healthy as I can because on the average day I would not be indulging in a shit ton of greasy foods. I'm gonna stick to the routine and the healthy habits that we're used to. I watched all of Love is Blind, so now I think I'm just gonna continue to keep scrolling on YouTube. Maybe a motivational video, a vlog. Still just relaxing. While I was setting my goals and intentions for this week, I decided to do a lot of reading and journaling. I really love self-motivational books. Secure the bag alert. I got a two piece with french fries and a biscuit and coke. This will also conclude the video. I am just going to eat and then once I eat and watch a episode or two of whatever show, I'm going to do my nighttime skincare routine and drink some green tea. I'm going to call it a night. I'm going to get up and be productive with the to-do list that I created earlier. I already got the weekend planned out and I am set and I'm ready to go. I feel motivated. I feel good. I had a great, great day with you guys. I do hope that you enjoyed. If you did enjoy, click that like button. Don't forget to comment and subscribe and share this video to all of the girls out there. Let them know. Slow productivity. You can still keep up with your goals. You can still keep up with your healthy habits and still be that girl. Catch you next video. Bye.